many days are in the years of the 70 weeks prophecy of Daniel? This is part five in the series. We know that Daniel prophesied about 77s or weeks. Each seven equals seven years. Therefore, 70 times seven equals 490 years. How many days are in each of these years? Daniel 7.25, we're told, And he, the Antichrist, shall speak great words against the Most High, and shall wear out the saints of the Most High, and they shall be given into his hand until a time, times, and the dividing of time. The time in the Royal Aramaic stands for one year. The word times is a dual and stands for two years. In English, we have the word both that stands for two, which is a similar usage. Time equals one year, times equals two year, and the dividing of time a half year. So we're talking about a period of three and one half years. In Daniel chapter 12 verse 7 we find time, times, and a half time, meaning three and a half years. In Daniel chapter 9 verse 27 it speaks of the last half of the week or half of the seven. This also means three and a half years. Our great advantage is that we have the book of Revelation. Revelation 11.3 speaks of this three and a half year time period as 1260 days. Revelation 12.6 also speaks of this same time period as 1260 days. Revelation chapter 12 verse, four, verse 14 uses the very terminology of Daniel. Time, times, and a half time speaking again of the three and a half year period. To discover how many days are in each year of Daniel's prophecy, we need to divide three and a half into 1260. That would be 3.5 into 1260. It goes 360 times. To check our work about how many days, we multiply 360 days times three and a half, and we come out with the number 1260. Therefore, each year in the prophecy of Daniel has 360 days. Notice the chart we have on the screen. Uh, weeks, seven weeks and 62 weeks, that's 69 weeks. Then the time gap and one week. Uh, the seven weeks uh, equals 49 years, the 62 weeks 434 years, you add those together and you have 483 years. Then the church age begins and then finally when the church age ends with the rapture there are seven more years known as the tribulation. Uh, how many days are in those years? Well for seven uh, weeks or 49 years you come up with 17,640 days. For the 62 weeks or 434 years 156,000 240 days. When you add those together, it's 173,880 days. Then the undetermined amount of time, and then 2,520 days left in that great tribulation. The first two periods are consecutive. 69 weeks equals 483 years. 483 years contain 173,880 days. The Jews were already familiar with the 360 day a year calendar. The total number of prophetic years involved is multiplied by the number of prophetic days per year. That is 483 or 69 weeks, 483 years times 360 days. That's how we get the 173,880 days. It starts on March the 14th, 445 BC on our calendar. The date on our calendar uh, is when the, the decree to rebuild Jerusalem began. Then count off the days on our Julian calendar and when you add 173,880 days it will bring you to April the 6th AD 32. According to Sir Robert Anderson of Scotland Yard, this was the exact date of Palm Sunday of the year Christ was crucified. 69 sevens, the Bible says, unto Messiah the Prince. Jesus of Nazareth entered the city on the exact day prophesied by Daniel the prophet. Rabbi Nehemius, who lived 50 years before Christ, is cited as saying that the time given by Daniel for the Messiah's appearance could not go beyond 50 years. Because of Daniel's prophecy, Anna and Simeon were looking for Jesus Christ the Messiah. They had done their math. God honored them for their belief, and they lived to see the Lord God become man. That's why only Jesus of Nazareth can save. Acts 4.12 Neither is there salvation in any other, for there is none other name under heaven given among men, whereby we must be saved. No one else could be the Messiah. He had to come at that exact time and on that exact day. 
He came and died for our sin, was buried, and rose the third day. He will save anyone who will call on his name. To receive Jesus as Lord and Savior, call 1-800-JESUS-2000. That's 1-800-JESUS-2000. Until next time, remember to search the scriptures. Jesus said, they are they which testify of me.